Okay. Okay. Do you um, want to go first sure. or should I? All right, go for it. Hi, I'm Laura and I'm 32. I'm Mel and I'm 24. I'm Dakota, I'm 25. And I'm Melissa and I'm 35. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> What's something you're insecure about in your group of friends? My two best friends from childhood are in relationships right now. So it makes me feel a little insecure, especially that these two girls are um, sort of going through this journey together. So it's just kind of general self-doubt about how others perceive me. I talk a lot. I talk really loud sometimes. I don't I can't even hear how loud I'm speaking. Someone's like, you know you're, ye you're yelling, right? <laughs> I did not know. Thank you for telling me. I think we all feel just a little bit of anxiety about um, not measuring up. I might feel insecure with people who may not be true friends, and that's when you start feeling like you're not smart enough, you're not fun enough, you're not talented mm. enough. A component of true friendship is you don't feel insecure. When I was younger, I might keep a friend who makes me feel insecure. Yeah. Well, I don't do that anymore. See, yeah. And that's a lovely thing about aging. Uh, what are the most important qualities in a friend? Being a good friend is to be dependable, mm. to be mm -hmm. there. Somebody who's, who's there, mm -hmm. you know, they are present. I think showing up when it matters. I think that's the most important thing always. Um, how do you want to be a better friend? I'm a really good friend. No, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> I know, they're like, hmm. Making sure that I always show up and understand the importance of that. I think sometimes I'll think of someone in the course of whatever. I wish more often I would just pick up the phone or send mm. the text. Revealing my flaws so that if I'm vulnerable to them, with them, maybe they would be so with me too and we can... Right actually be more supportive, more authentic. I'd like to do a better job of showing up emotionally and in being able to verbalize that. But I don't know that I'm always very good at verbalizing like the kind of support I want to give. I have some friends who've been going through hard times. And one thing I'd like to be able to grow in is my capacity to be a good friend um, in times uh, when they are suffering deeply in ways that I can't fully relate to yet because I haven't had those same life experiences. I was 18 and my mom passed away, so most of my, pretty much all my friends like, had not, thank God, like gone through that yet. I think I always try and remind myself that it was rare that I would ever like reach out to a friend and say, hey, I'm not doing okay. Support me. Anytime you go through loss, it's your friends that carry you through. Indeed. All right, are we ready for our next question? Yes. Okay. Such a dangerous pile. <laughs> This is a terrible question.